that um, uh, as the community uh, changes and uh, evolves, uh, if we want that level of service to continue, um, they're feeling that they need another three officers, but uh, uh, to help off with the budget, uh, putting that off till September, it'll take that long to um, try and get those officers in at any rate. So that, that helps offset some of the impacts for this year's budget, but you'll feel the full impact next year. Councillor Beppel. Thanks. So the maximum number we've ever approved for CAMLIPS is 115. Um, that that's funding. For funding. Yes. That's the maximum the council has ever approved. And right now we have 112. Have we ever had more than 112 members here? Uh, well, no. We have 120 six members right but in terms of people working, actually working um that are in active service actually working this year you've had 112. have we ever had more than that no no and that, that goes back four or five years ago when our funded levels were in the 80s well in 2007 we went from 112 to 115 i think is that right i believe so okay so i'm just i it because it seems like things are going really well and um, we've got the most police that we've ever had and the crime rates are actually for the most part going down which is a good thing so uh, I, 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 it's easier to sell me on getting more police when crime rates are going up or <laughs> when the population is going up in a, a, a large amount but our, our population is fairly flat and the crime rates are going down and we've had we have more police than we ever have have ever had so convince me that we need more police yeah and we, we could spend an awful lot of time doing that but the complexity of police work um, is uh, more demanding every year it's more demanding in terms of disclosure in court in terms of how court packages have to be put together in terms of how the member how the members have to spend time in court uh, there's it just becomes increasingly and and more difficult all the time and uh, what we used to be able to do uh, you know an impaired driver in about an hour and 15 minutes now takes four or five hours for somebody to do the paperwork on it's it's that's a very simple example but when you start get into uh, for example, uh, a homicide investigation where you uh, you would think that uh, you know you can walk up and find a body outside and then go in the house and check. You can't. You have to get a search warrant to go in there. The search warrant's going to take five or six hours to prepare, or maybe even overnight. So those kind of complexities uh, forced upon us by the courts and other things make the work more difficult. So. Um, Although you might think that the crime rate's going down, I can assure you that the quality of work is is more demanding than each year it becomes more demanding. But the quality of work that our staff in Kamloops are putting out is better quality work. And I don't want to say that that would suffer if we didn't get more people, but you know the work is more demanding all the time. Hope that answers your question. Councillor Wallace. Uh, thank you. This morning, Superintendent, we heard that we had a whole bunch of new taggers along with the ones we've always had. Uh, would, it, would it be uh, accurate to suggest that uh, uh, people that uh, uh, thieves, uh, car thieves, uh, scam artists move in, in, town, in and out of town, maybe not eight at a time, but that's along with the, the local stuff that happens of impaired driving and disagreements, that, that also happens so that it's hard to gauge on any given day exactly. Uh, you know what you have to do is routine, but then the rest of it uh, uh, is, is, is not even good for a guest because there really isn't any way to uh, surmise if there's going to be five stolen cars whipped through here or, or none. Yeah, and, and Kamloops being sort of at the crossroads, we do get transient criminals through here, so our work is up and down. Uh, but we are fairly steady in the in the... You know, we have uh, a core group of people in town that we monitor that, that are, for lack of a better term, career c criminals um, that keep us busy enough. Um, we don't need other people coming to town, and we try and discourage that. So, uh, you know, it is easy to say that, yes, we do have our ups and downs. Okay. Thank you.